Hello, it's Tom. Can you hear the little robin? You might be able to see him. Welcome to Soft Talk ASMR. This is your chance to relax. Really melt into the here and now. This is only going to be a short video, a little catch up video. But I'm absolutely mesmerised by that robin. I've really found this season, this winter, such a strong, there you go, such a strong association and respect and just a total admiration for the robin for all robins so if your name's robin that's great too I think these are called snowberry. Are they snowberry? Form of snowberry, pink. Yeah. Well, look, daffodils. Daffodils are growing. Well, the, the stems are, the shoots are. So hello to all my subscribers. Hello Craig. Hello Stephanie and Rafa. Hello Swarms Me. Hello Mike. Hello to all my regular viewers. Thank you for your interest in the channel. Hello Tim. Yeah, we had a coconut at Christmas, a little treat and uh, place some pieces of the coconut here and they have moved so it looks like some some birds have picked up a few pieces perhaps. I wondered if it might be helpful for their nesting for their nesting material. I've been watching the blackbirds like I always do every January. They tend to hang around a lot on the grass on the lawn. I think they're looking for their their new mates for the new year. These are all the daffodil bulbs I planted out at the end of the summer, early autumn. Also, you may recall, do you remember I planted the lavender? I grew these from cuttings, that's three cuttings there. And this is uh, just a piece of artificial uh, shielding. May need to stop Callum weighing on it, give it a chance to grow. <laughs> Still got a couple of videos to upload yet. I did very well yesterday morning. Let's take this off. Finding the the settling in that I'm talking about helpful, where you melt into where you are into the land. I hope that's advice that might be helping some of you. 
definitely helps with with clearing stuff out your head i feel the the it's a form of meditation in itself isn't it just centering in letting everything flow little robin's back on his usual perch again I'm saying all this without moving my voice. Talk <laughs> <laughs> to that bird. Well, I look forward to the warmer weather here when it comes. It's a cold day today. Very chilly. And, um, they say it's going to get a lot colder and uh, the wind of course keeps that, that cold. There he is, little Robin, hello. I'm going to turn over this. Yeah, he might come closer, that'd be, that'd be really good. See if I can get some closer footage for you of the mob. This is my dad doing a little bit of gardening. See if we can encourage the robin to come down. Yes, I can see some. some worms. Come on, come and get your breakfast. Dinner is served. Look. Get out of the window. Little Robin, come down, yay! He's come down a bit into the bushes. Can you see him? See if we can get him to come over this way. The Robin Whisperer. I hope you can see all that, that's beautiful. It's gone back up into the tree now, into the apple tree. It's amazing, I feel at times I have a greater connection to nature, the animal kingdom than I do with people. But then I think that's probably because years of being bullied, years of being intimidated. I know that Robin's not going to hurt me. enjoyed that video. What should I call this one? The Robin Whisperer, mm, maybe. I don't think I showed you the painting I did of the Robin, did I? Let me go and get the Robin painting. See you soon. Some worms, something to eat soon. Yeah. Alright, let's go and get the robin painting.
the, the little painting I did of the robin which I did just before Christmas. There's Faith or Michael. I think this one's Faith. The blue, the blue ray. Before I show you the Robin painting, I've been keeping my old nanny's geraniums going. In fact, it was two cuttings I did from one geranium, and I've kept these going a while. And uh, I've come up with the idea of doing geranium essential oil. I've not made it yet, but I'll see how it goes. I'm going to do a test, a test one. I've got the, uh, the uh, I've lit the hob, the cooker, so I'll show you that now. So, geranium. I'm going to make essential oil from geraniums. Just thought this might make good ASMR, actually, mightn't it? That's the doorbell, there's Cat Callum. Can you hear Callum in the back? Very, very timely when we're making videos. I wonder if this is a, a bit of a blooper, I'm not sure. So I'm cooking the geranium with some special ingredients, shall we say. Uh, then it's resting in a, a little saucepan of water, just gently simmering away. It's been on for about ooh, two and a half hours now. So that's something being creative, helping the sacral chakra and uh, obviously helping the, my own mental health keeping busy in a creative and positive and achieving way There we are, there's the Robin painting Robin, Billy Morgan and Callum with three Tahiti daffodils the tree of tree and uh, Mr. Mr. Wuzzle Gummidge's three crows on the ten acre field perhaps. Interestingly pink and green, I didn't really plan that but there's a, a nod there to the heart chakra so that's lovely. There we are, Robin. Always find a friend in a Robin. <laughs> we're sticking with paintings there's a Metatron's cube no I didn't paint that no I didn't paint that but, uh, I think that's is it, that's not the flower of life I'm not sure what that is but that's definitely Metatron's cube and you may have seen this already it's Archangel Metatron It's been a slightly longer video than I planned. Thank you, Metatron. Thank you for supporting and guiding me, comforting and healing me. And thank you for sticking by me, all of you. Just be with that flow of life. Allow everything, all the stuff stuck, energy that's within you and within your aura, let it all pass now. Clear it to the light joyfully. And you're fully protected. As ever with loving kindness, I shall talk to you.